Hey good people, Mary Vlogmas. So in today's video, I wanted to participate in the It Was So Nice, I Brought It Twice luxury tag. I saw the tag in um, High Low Lux, one of her Vlogmas videos, and I wanted to do it too. Ain't nobody invite me. I invited myself to the party, okay? <laughs> I wanted to do the tag, so let's get into it. I saw Janae do it in, um, I don't remember which Vlogmas video, but she did it and I was like, yes, yes. I don't think she created to tag, she credited who created the, the luxury tag, but whoever did it, props to them. Props to Hilo Lux for doing it, to inspire me to do it. And let's get into what I brought twice. So these items are gonna be in no particular order, I'm just grabbing. So the first pair I want to show is these two. It was so nice, I brought it twice. So the Toiletry 26, very versatile. I'm sure you know how you can use it now as a clutch, as a toiletry, as a cloth body. But then, well my husband actually got me this for Valentine's Day. Uh, whatever year this came out, that's that's when he got it for me. But he knew I loved this one, so we got me this one. And I don't know whether I wear this one more because it's sentimental. Back, cause you know my husband brought me this one, or because you know I got a little got a little extra stuff on it. But this is from the Game On collection. First set of it was so nice. I brought it twice. Okay, well, I really just brought it once. My husband brought it twice, but you know. Is money my money same thing? Is no okay. Moving on. <laughs> this is my next set of it was so nice. I brought it twice. So this is the Coach. Both of them are the Coach pillow tabby bags. This is the large. Obviously, this is the mini. I have not worn the mini yet. Um, I don't actually. I just. I don't know why. I just haven't. Maybe I haven't had an outfit yet that. I wanted to wear it with, but just, I, I still love it. Like it's mine and it ain't going nowhere. Um, love this one. The leather on these are so baby buttery soft. The poofiness of course is a trend now, but it's also to me just adorable. You have this and then of course you have the long shoulder strap that comes with both of them. This one, the mini also comes with a detachable is it adjustable and adjustable shoulder strap so love it the leather on these coach pillow tabbies when i got so i got the large one first the when i got the large one and i felt the leather it was so impressive the it was so impressive so got both of these so nice brought it twice i'm including my speedy 30s because buying one inspired me to buy the other one so this is a Speedy 30, but this is a Speedy Bandolier with, with the strap. And then this is just a Speedy 30 without the strap. The space, the casual elegance of these Speedies, they will encourage anybody to buy multiples. So these are both my Speedy 30s. This one is a Speedy B though in Damier Ben. This is my Speedy 30 in monogram. This is a little special. This is my birthday bag. I got this pre-love because I was specifically looking for a Speedy with that was manufactured in my birth year and birth month. And then I sent it to Louis Vuitton to have them replace the leather for me. So, so nice, brought it twice. I had talked about these before in my gift guide, luxury gift guide videos, one of them. Um, but I love these Gucci. Yes, they're very popular. Yes, everybody and their mommy and their auntie got one. But but it's for a reason. Like the popularity is for these belts are one very comfortable, one very versatile. Like depending on your base tone of your outfits, these are gonna go with anything and everything. So I love these belts. They hold up great. I've had both of these for at least 
for at least three years for at least three years and the hardware isn't scratched the leather is still nice and supple i love these belts the you can have on a very plain outfit jeans white t-shirt throwing this belt and these these belts automatically help your outfit do a little song song you know without without effort at all like at all just put your belt on you don't need no just put your belt on love these belts so nice i brought it twice i'm lying so nice i brought it four times <laughs> but in my defense i got the other two in the skinny version so i y'all know how i feel about the thicker version so i wanted to get those two i haven't gotten first this one is new i brought this one this year and then this one i can't remember how old this is but this is not as old as i haven't had them as long as i've had the the thicker versions but nice but i needed the thinner versions for more elegant outfits or more um classic put together or even for sundresses when I, instead of going around my waist, I wanted to belt it, you know, up here. But love these belts. Um, the black one I have not worn yet. Cause like I said, it's fairly new. They came out with the matte black um, this year, but so nice girl. I bought it four times, <laughs> but I love them. My next pair are the Sunrev Maestro bags. This is the mini, the smallest size that they make. And then this is, I think it's just the Maestro bag, the largest size that they make. So I purchased this one first. I fell in love with the wine color and the versatility and the leather is just so quality, it's so sturdy. I originally wanted to use this as a work bag because one, it's understated. Sunrev is not as loud or even as popular as say your louis vuitton your gucci your chanel so i thought this would be you know appropriate for work you know so i don't want to flex at work all the time <laughs> or do i know <laughs> but i brought this one and also you can wear these bags three ways you can wear it as a shoulder bag you can pull this out and wear it as a backpack and then of course you can wear it cross body but love this bag i love the unique latch i just i love that um and then the gray microfiber interior you don't gotta worry about your items getting scratched up inside and then i just have it stuffed and then inside i don't have to buy an organizer for either one of these bags because they come already so well organized with a bunch of pockets love this bag but then when i got this bag i realized especially when i was going to work in the office uh i take everything in the kitchen sink <laughs> so yes and then you know the wine color it, it wasn't practical for every day as beautiful as it was so i got the larger one in black and i love it it is it's so functional um I have nothing I have nothing the price point on these are phenomenal and I'm figuring the price point is uh they run about seven eight hundred dollars for the small one and then the large about eleven hundred dollars if I'm not mistaken but I I'm assuming the price is still so low in the the world of luxury handbags <laughs> don't go for me in a world of luxury handbags it is still so low because you know they're still trying to get their name out there they're not as popular as a design house as like i said your louis your gucci so i figured that's why they're still reasonably low but they are worth every penny they're, they're the quality of the letter in my opinion is actually worth a little bit more but i'm glad i ain't gonna have to worry about that in the future <laughs> love it so nice i brought it twice y'all know i i rave about this bag these bags these are my boss bags they're so well made they are classics they are sturdy they are carefree they are roomy they are they are everything <laughs> okay i love this bag i have raved about the Givenchy Antigona so much y'all already know but 
just had to remind you so nice i brought it twice these are my two speedy bandolier 25s so i got this one obviously in canvas and the damier azor and then this one is in the emprunt leather the speedy b25 is such a good size it is such a good size i have the speedy 20 that just came out i love it for quick runs for you know maybe a movie night something like that but every day use give me a give me a 25 give me a 25 give me a 30 depending on what i'm doing where am i going a, tw a speedy 20 is a nice novelty like i said it's a nice quick run it's a nice movie date night it's a nice maybe going to a festival maybe you with your spouse so you know you don't have to bring the whole house with you something like that but every day a speedy 25 or a speedy 30 in my in my in so humble opinion <laughs> but love this size i already told y'all i love the speedy nice classic silhouette the most elegant casual bag i think you can have okay speedy 25 so nice i brought it twice look i'm gonna stop saying that tagline y'all know y'all know what it is it's nice and i brought it twice maybe sometime more than twice <laughs> so my next set are the louis vuitton shawls so so nice i brought them four times so but two of them are shine and then two of them are the regular not shine nah. <laughs> so this is the black shine and then this is the denim shine this is a gray, this is a mid-tone gray, and then this is like a baby pink. These scarves are so easy to style. You can get it together, <laughs> you, can, you can do that too. But you can wear them traditionally, you can do, you know, your bib style, I call it bib style, <laughs> do your bib style, they are so versatile, especially depending on the, the color or the color scheme that you get. And then the best part is that with the one scarf, you can wear it on both sides. Okay. Love them. So this is my next trio. My set of Neverfulls. These two are the MM size. And then this one is the GM size. If you don't know about Neverfull, I, I, I'm going to need you to know about Neverfull. Okay. <laughs> convenient that's what describes to me the epitome of convenience is a never full okay this is uh they, they have let me put okay let me put this down lord my arms okay so never full is convenient okay it's a very casual convenience a very chic casual convenience a never full one is a classic two is super easy to carry three it's going to help you throughout your day because it's an open hole you just literally bloop bloop everything you need or pull out throughout the day and not to mention it's a great investment piece and it's also a great starter piece okay a louis vuitton never full is a classic and yes, I, I same thing with Speedy. Oh, it's basic. Everybody and their grandmama got it. And okay, <laughs> it's a good bag, and everybody has it for a reason. And I was about to say it's it's low maintenance, but eh, depending on the canvas that you get. But now they also have uh, a leather never full. I'm not really sure if that's on my radar or not, but that's not what we're here to talk about. That's not what we're here to talk about. But the Vachetta makes the monogram a little less carefree. However, however, <laughs> you know your girl got you. These are absolutely carefree, okay? These are absolutely carefree. The Damier Ben, what Ray marks, huh? Damier Ben, too, is too carefree. Okay, and then the World Tour, you can't, so this is when World Tour 
line first got introduced but you can now go online you can customize and get the monogram with the black trim you don't have to get all the world tour stickers you can customize the sticker if you're not a fan of the stickers get one i think you do have to get at least one but you know get a small one stick it in a corner I, it, it, it's not it's not hard it's when, listen, when I say carefree, you got the monogram and the black leather, both the best of both worlds. And then Damier Ben, this print, this print go with everything. This print go with everything but polka dots. I stand by that. <laughs> I told y'all, the quality of the Marc Jacobs tote, is it, or is it just the Marc, oh, the tote bag. I'm wrong all day. But... <laughs> So it's called the tote bag, but it's by Marc Jacobs. But the quality of this leather for the price point, it was so nice. I brought it three times. Well, no, I brought it twice because this one is <laughs> this one is canvas. But so this is the tote bag in the large size. Am I lying? Or is this the medium? No, the large. Is it? Uh, no, I'm lying. So this is the medium. They have a another version. Oh, I ain't eat my Wheaties today. So <laughs> this is the medium. They have a size larger than this, but this is the medium. Look, just me holding it like this and gripping the bottom. The softness of this grain leather for this price point, I'm impressed. I'm still impressed. Of course I was impressed because I got, I got another one. So this was the last, this is the newest one that I have. I brought this one first. I had to think. I brought this one first. <sighs> Obviously, I was impressed with the leather. I was impressed with the quality. So the color, though, I didn't want to wear it every day because I was, you know, afraid of color transfer. And then I didn't want to beat it up because I was so impressed. So I didn't want to beat it up. So I went and I got the canvas one. When I say so carefree so the make of the canvas like with the stitching i'm not as impressed with the make of it as i am the leather because some of the stitching you know you can see you can see they have the sewing machine correctly <laughs> lied <laughs> but it's not bad it's not bad right it's not bad but you can tell this is not um don't want to say as high end but you could tell there's a quality and then obviously a price difference i think the canvas one retailed for 150 i think this one refilled for 150 if i'm not mistaken if i'm mistaken then i'll make sure i leave a correction on the screen but so this the canvas one was 150 and then the small leather tote was 500 so, you know, for the price difference, obviously there's going to be a quality difference because the stitching on the leather one, on both leather ones, immaculate. Nope, not, not a problem. Like, not a flaw, not a problem. I can't say that about the canvas one. But for the price, it's still worth it. It is convenient. It is durable. I got the denim color. This is such an easy grab and go bag when I just need to go get out the door. I'm not going nowhere too fancy. Uh, I just grab this, grab this, dump everything inside. It is a canvas hole in there. I haven't spilled anything on it or got even close to it. I'm not sure if it's wipeable or mine hasn't gotten dirty yet. So I haven't had to set it off to get it clean so i don't know how that's going to go eventually but of course i will keep y'all updated but nothing but good things to say love these bags okay good people that is it those are all of my i thought was so nice and i brought it twice again i was not invited to do this tag i saw it on janae's channel hilo lux and i thought that would be fun because i have a i'm a creature of habit when I see something that I like or I find something that works for me, I tend to want to get different variations of it. So, you know, I can I can keep with my cool 
casual, comfortable vibes. You know, love it. But that is my version. Nobody invited me, but I'm inviting you. You know, I want my fam to let me know what did you guys buy multiple times or what do you have one of that you have intentions on getting another one of. And if you have a YouTube channel, make a video and tag me. I want to see. I want to see. Y'all know I'm nosy. I want to see. But thanks, you guys, for joining me again on another Vlogmas. If you haven't already, please, please, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Turn on those notifications. You can keep up with your girl on her social media. I am on TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, at Rakita's Closet everywhere. Also, for any details on me or other videos or things that I purchase, hit me up on my blog. It is at www.rakitascloset.com. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye!